Oh, but I, it's so good to be back with you guys, and it's good. Because you know, you know what happened is like, I bet as COVID is, it was easy because I tried. The other day I went to the airport to travel, and TSA, they go, you have your mask on? I go, yeah, they go, go ahead. I'm like, you don't understand, I'm from the Middle East. <laughs> Normally I can't run through the airport. <laughs> I always miss my connection flights. But this time with COVID, like, you don't have a fever, go ahead. Like, no, 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 you don't understand. Uh, you guys know me as random check. <laughs> <clears throat> Go ahead. It used to be horrible, people. I used to watch the news every night, and I'm praying, oh, whenever there's a shooting or bombing, please, Lord Jesus, don't let it be a Middle Eastern. Please. Hurricane, let it be Hurricane Bob, Hurricane Matthew, not Hurricane Abdul, <laughs> or Hurricane Ahmed. Because whenever these terrorists did something, we Middle Eastern people could not do it anymore. Like, I can't fly a plane anymore. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't rent a truck anymore. I can't buy nights from Bed Bath & Beyond anymore. I have to wait two weeks for a federal background check. What do you need them for, salad? Why can't these terrorists do something I don't want to do, like blow up a colonoscopy clinic or something? But my name is Nazareth. I was born in the city of Nazareth in Israel. And it's a family tradition to name you after the city you're born in. I feel sorry for my brother Waikiki. <laughs> my other brother Albuquerque. <laughs> my sister Buffalo. <laughs> location, location, location. But it's so good to see men with no masks on. Man, I miss noses. I miss people's noses. I took it for granted. Now I'm looking at people's noses. Yeah. Because, you know, I have to be honest. In the beginning of the COVID, I got scared. Uh, I sanitized so much. I looked like a newborn baby dripping. One time I got pulled over for a DUI. I don't even drink, but my blood alcohol level was so high. And I had an open container of Purell in my car. But, uh, but it's just hard, because you know, I'm tired of doing Zoom. Do you guys have to do Zoom, some of you? Aren't you tired of Zoom? Ah, I did one for the seniors at my church. Now, some seniors are good with Zoom, the others were not. One guy had his eye on the camera. <laughs> Another guy had his ear with hair. And you're like, uh, Another guy was talking to it. It's like a puzzle. You move the boxes around, you get one face. That's you. But I love California, man. Gas price is what, $5 a gallon? Not only I shake the nozzle, I now lick it. <laughs> and crime is up. I live in Corona, people. Corona, California. And uh, you know, a safe area. A few weeks ago, two burgers, three in the morning, break into my house, three in the morning. And you know, so I, I pulled my fake gun because I live in California. And they were wearing like all black, black hats, black mask. So I took my gun and just got on the I said, hey, are you vaccinated? <laughs> I'm like, you don't need your mask then. <laughs> <laughs> but Corona, yeah. So, you know, we stayed home for a while. For the first time, I got to watch, to watch the Olympics. And one guy, you know, from our area won the discus throw. You know that discus throw? That guy. That's my Amazon delivery guy. 